Hey guys, what's up? It's Drizzo Dragon Player, and today I'm making this small little video over what I'm calling my uh, squad expeditionary force. Uh, it's not fully completed yet. I've downsized it for tournaments that I play here in my home state of Illinois. Um, but yeah, this is basic, and I also lost my codex, so. This is just great, but um, I'm figuring out points values and stuff for this, but um, starting off, this first squad we have includes my Warlord Draco, and three of what I'm calling Swarm Tactical Marines. Basically, um, they're Assault Marines, but they basically just all have Vultures except for the Flamer that I'm going to do once or twice. And I'm testing out this new color scheme, which is actually Bronze and white and blue eyes and I think that kind of really nice. I, these were just sloppy mess arounds, like just trying to do it. Of course Draco's always going to be green, because green is my favorite color. And he does have a custom chaos home, which I will get into in a second when I go rules for most of these. Um, they have a few custom homebrew rules. Nothing extreme, but it, I'll explain it in a second. They all ride in a Razorback, equipped with blast cannons. It did use to have a Storm Vulture and a Missile Launcher, both of which got knocked off. But I'm, I'm just going to play it with blast cannons, as that's all it's kind of need. It doesn't really need Storm Vultures, because they're not like this. And it's also got Razor Blades. I really like this. This was one of my earliest models I painted up, and I really like how the black and the silver and green color scheme came out. The door, of course, still opens. I didn't really paint inside there. You can't really see inside. But uh, yeah, I didn't really paint inside there. Um, the next thing we have are three bikers. Um, one with a plasma gun, two with plasma pistols. This bike I made custom, I don't know. Um, but those are my bikes when I need to finish making them for the first day of Which I will get to sometime. They look presentable for now. Um, so going over the custom rules for some of my figures, and most of them, uh, it's mostly just the swarm tacticals. Um, so Draco, of course, uh, he has artifice armor, arm-mounted plasma pistol, power maul, and uh, power sword. Uh, he also has a jump pack, so he basically has dual weapons, an arm mounted weapon, the artificer armor, and the jump pad. And he is pretty cool. Uh, the artificer armor he wears gives him a 2 plus 8, which most of you already know. Um, the dragon helm, that basically gives him, that's also part of the artificer armor. It doesn't have any special rules, it's just included as special warrior because. Um, it is master crafted and stuff. Power Mall is master crafted and the power sword is not. Swarm tacticals. These guys are basically veterans, but they all kill vultures and basically you roll for them if they're basically tactical. But since they are equipped with jump paths, even though they're not assault marines, they do get a special weapon tool. So basically they get special anyway. The Razorback has nothing and the bikes just have them. That's basically my army list right now, guys. I know it's not that many points. I'm working on it. I'm looking for my codex so I can do stuff. Um, but that's basically my army list for right now, guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, and there will be more soon. Thanks for watching. Draco Minis, signing